As we mentioned earlier, Taste of Charlotte cut short today because of the downpour. The festival was supposed to come to a close around now, but it was forced to shut down much earlier. WCNC Charlotte's Jesse Pear live in Uptown now after speaking to some visitors and vendors hoping to get uh, some, you know, more activity and maybe a bite or two in today about this anticlimactic ending to the festival, Jesse. That's right. You know what I will say with the event shutting down, I've seen a lot more business on some of the restaurants that are nearby. Now, you know, a few hours ago, the rain was coming down pretty heavy. Right now, we kind of have a light drizzle, but sometimes it feels like it's picking up. Now, the Taste of Charlotte Festival was on its third day. Now, folks who came out on Friday, Saturday, and even earlier today, Definitely lucked out with some nice weather, but this afternoon the storm definitely caused the event to shut down early. Now organizers say they were keeping their eye on the weather. Some of the vendors that were here tell me like this was a big surprise. They didn't expect the rain to be this heavy, this strong, but about 30 minutes before that happened, before the rain started pouring down, police told them to start alerting vendors to close down and to shut down the event completely. And just before three three o'clock uh, this afternoon, the update came down on social media by the festival organizers saying the Food Lion Taste of Charlotte Festival was officially closed because of the storm and the really bad weather. Now this weekend brought out about 200,000 people. Today was another busy day before folks were cleared out by the rain. We were kind of on a roll and it was really last minute just being told like, hey, the police officers are shutting us down. And so it was really chaotic. Honestly, everyone was kind of like going a little crazy. The water was flowing through the tent, like underneath, and my feet are soaked. So. <laughs> So as you can see, the barriers are still up and the road is still closed and a lot of the vendors pretty much inside, you know, still cleaning up and clearing out. Equipment is being wrapped and put away. Now I have seen quite a few people still stop by with the umbrellas, still hoping that the event is going on, but no, it is officially closed. Obviously people are still enjoying the rain and uh, the nice weather and not letting it keep them inside. Um, but overall, you know, the festival went for three days they had two uh, full days that were really beautiful, nice day, and a few hours earlier today. And vendors say they were really grateful for that time. Live in Uptown, sending it back to you, Jane, Jesse Pierre, WCNC Charlotte. Nice enough to get back on the bike and uh, have a little uh, mobile bar around Uptown. Thanks for that report. <laughs>